Today, I want to show you how to transfer your WhatsApp account from your old phone to your new phone. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do is to back up your data if it is not already backed up on your WhatsApp. If you don't know how to do that, please watch my other video up here or in the description below. The second step is to insert your SIM card from your old phone to your new phone. If you're using Android, then go to the Play Store. And if you're using iPhone, then go to the Apple Store. There, just simply search for WhatsApp. Make sure the app is actually from WhatsApp and then touch install. Then touch open. Obviously, you need to agree with the terms and conditions, so touch agree. Make sure your country is correct and your country code is correct and then enter your phone number. Then touch next. Double check the phone number you enter is correct. If it is correct, touch OK, if not, edit. So I touch OK. Because we put the SIM card to our new phone, when WhatsApp sent us the code, WhatsApp automatically read the code and verified our phone. And now, in order to restore the backup files, you need to allow it to access your device, photos, medias, and files. So touch continue to allow. Then your operating system would ask you, do you want to really allow? Then you should say allow. Again, you should say allow. Here, it is really important to select restore. If you read this message carefully, it says, if you don't do it now, you would not be able to do it later. So again, I have to emphasize, you need to press restore at this place and not press skip. So I touch on restore. First, it will restore my messages, which it does pretty quickly because they don't take a lot of space. And then in the background, it would restore the media. So you can just touch next, type your name and touch next. Here you can specify how often you wanna back up your data. You can say, for example, monthly, or you can say never. Then it will find you your Gmail accounts that you could save your data into your Google Drive. Select the one that you prefer. You could also add a new one and then touch done. And as you can see here, I got all my contacts. I got all my messages from my old phone appearing on my new phone. In this way, we have successfully transferred our WhatsApp account from our old phone to our new phone. I hope this video was useful. If it was, please don't forget to watch my other videos on my left and to subscribe to support my channel. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye.